I'm a little nervous. Really We're making tamales full. because that's all we do. We do it on our free time. We do it on the weekends. <laughs> we do it in the evenings. That's our pastime. That's our hobby. We love tamales. Whatever. So I'm You're not even liar. worried about it. You guys. You're a liar. We're making tamales. Anybody coming in? Anybody. Um, the actual professional is going to be an hour late. So that gives me um, a good hour to get it all down pat. Okay, we're doing it. Shut up. We're not nervous. Hey, Bootsy. Hey, Burks. Katie. Caddy. Caddy. Tell me how to say your name. Is it Caddy or Katie? So I'll know how to say it. Like Katie, Texas? Or is that Caddy, Texas? <laughs> uh, who knows? I'm sorry. Okay, you guys. We got to get started because it's going to be a little bit of a while. Brandy. Hi, Brandy. Holy I God. miss you, Mom. I talked to Olivia. She called me this morning. 9.30 in the morning, my niece, my, my great niece, called me. And she's like, hi, Bonnie. It's cat. Cat like cat. Caddy. Caddy. Nice. I'll remember that for next time. I have a really good memory. Watch <laughs> my famous last words. You're going to ask her again in about 10 minutes. Don't shut up. No, I'm not. Katie. Okay, we're ready. Ah! Okay. Calm down, everybody. Yeah. I mean, we, we we're all nerve wracked. We're all jacked up. <laughs> we are jacked. You guys, I boiled. The only thing I did was boil the carne. And chicharrones. Yes. This is the this is the bennies of of frying off and making your tamales. Is we have chicharrones, and they have carne. I don't know if everybody knows what that is, but this is actually the extra stuff. When you go into a Mexican restaurant, there's a glass window, and there's a bunch of chicharrones like curved, and you fry them. They're big. Pieces of fat, basically. Yeah, fried. That's the, what we did. We the just ones fried that big chunks of fat. The ones that have meat on them actually cost a little bit more. This is what came from it. All the fat that we're gonna use we for the got, pasta. Yes, you guys. That's we bought, came from making we, the chicharrones. We bought, we bought fat just to melt it down. Yeah, hey, did you we did. happen to dump the little piece of plastic that was here? Yes, you did. Because it's not here no more. What is it? It's it was a piece of plastic from the meat that said pork. Huh? Yes, it was right here. It was like the top of the meat when I take it off. It's okay. I'll just tell them. I just wanted to show them that it was called oh. pork fat. I'm sure I threw it away. How how wicked is that, y'all? Okay. It's just pork fat. Pork fat of the pork or something like that. Okay, there. JC Poo. Um, right. You guys, I'm going to take off. I we're, We've, uh, what's that called? You want to, like, you want to keep it on I'm going to take up? the meat off. I just want to show them that I'm going to take the rest of the meat out. Yeah, we boiled the meat. Oh, yeah, you can bring them over here so they can see the meat. Yeah. We, bo where are you? Right there. Okay. I put my chili peppers in there. My peppers, what are they called? Chili peppers. Yeah, these. Oh, those. Yeah, those. <laughs> these that we got in there now. Yeah. Those were in with, those are onions, and those are the, uh, what are they? Garlic and onion. Garlic and onion, and what are the rest? Bailey, oh, what? The red peppers? What kind of are oh, they? Oh, they're called ancho chilies. Ancho chilies. The dried ones. And this is a pork. And we put those in that bucket with the, or that pot that she's taking the pork bone. The pork, see how clean that bone is? That's how you test it. Watch. Here we go. This bone Watch. just falls right off of the pork butt. And then she's pulling the rest of the pork butt out, and we're going to shred that. And then That's... the chilies were in there. When they got soft, we took them out, and we put them in the blender. So they're just sitting in there right now. We haven't blended it yet. We're waiting for you guys. Yeah, no blending. We're taking the rest of the pork out. It looks like it could be medieval. And all the onions, all the onions we took out and we put in the blender. Yep. All the any vegetables we had, we put in the blender with the chiles, right? Okay. So Here, this, right there. Yep. I got I got I can't do this. I know you hate it to be like Yeah, cuz my arms I'm stretching my arm out about a mile out there <laughs> trying so to get everything in. In here were I don't even know what they're called. They're those peppers. Or they're They're chilies. like ancho chilies. Or ancho chilies. Yeah. But they're dried and everything. So we had yeah. to throw them in there, boil them up. There's the onion in there. You guys can see the onion on the side. There's garlics down on the bottom. So I'm going to get, we're going to shred this and we're going to put some of this juice in there. Yep. Okay. But first. I'm going to set you down here, y'all. I'm so nervous. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm going to shred this for you real quick. Okay. So I'm going to. Take gonna... out any big chunks of fat. If there's anything that's not rendered. All right. All right. Then we're gonna, we're gonna you do whatever you got to do, man. Okay? I'm just. I'm all stoked and hella freaked. All right. We got this, Joe. Jeez. They act like we've never made oh, dinner. I'm just the fat that I can, that's any in Nate, big can they chunks see you? or whatever. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Just so they can see something. Okay, yeah. So take anything. 
everything that's not meat out. And we shredded a little bit beforehand. I don't even, so here's big just... chunks of fat, that's all. Chunks of fat that have not completely rendered. Go ahead, baby. What do you want? Okay, to I am gonna put... Oh, there's stuff on the bottom. Oh, there's pieces of meat. Is there? I think. Some fill up. <laughs> I'm all surprised. <laughs> sure, there should be. Yeah, I'm sure it's fallen. Everything's falling off the bone. Oh, no, 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 no. We're good. We're good. We're good? Yep. It's going to get blended. It's going to turn into like a a maroon paste. I mean, um, so, what's that called? A uh, brown, or uh, whatever, chili red, powder paste. Red, yeah, red, red paste. Red paste. All right, so. And this is what we're going to put in our chili powder, or in our masa. We should probably should have done our masa first, right? Yeah, we'll, we'll do that in a minute. Let's just okay. keep on with the one subject at a time. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> okay, so, so we'll do that in a minute. Okay, so here I am. Yeah. You, here I am. You want me to do it? Here we uh, All right. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to take and pull the meat apart with the fork first. Just kind of shred it first. You don't want it stringy in there, so you don't want to leave it, you know, long like that. So what we're going to do, I'll show you what we're going to do. You guys, fat. we started it about, mm, what time did I put it on about, baby? Any gristle or fat, you just want to take out. I might, I think I put it on around 3, 3 o'clock, so it went for about 2. And you don't, want to take, you don't want to take forks and do this and do that just yet. What you're just pulling it apart. This is a trick from my my uh, better half. I've never made them. My grandma, I've helped my grandma make them. I mean, being around it. And then you're all solo and you have to do it yourself. That's the right. part that's nerve wracking. So once you get it to this. See the difference between this texture versus this? Okay. This looks like just a pulled pork. So now we're just going to take our fingers, which are clean. See and that? we're just going to close. mush it. Hold on a minute. See that up close how it's just long strands? You want it to be this consistency. It's yeah. a more of a tininess. Yeah, like little, like, yep. like that. Yep. Yep. Little pieces. So that's what I'm going to do with the stuff that I just shredded. I'm going to mush it up. Okay. What am I, what am I doing? Just staring at my baby. <laughs> the I know, she looks so precious. Just take it and mush it together. Mush it hard. Get No, Mama, get up there. No, no. you cannot be down here. Hey, oh, get up there. I don't like you get guys there, in the kitchen when I'm cooking. Get up there. You know that. I know, they want to see the dogs. No. We, we we'll show them to them later. We we told yeah. them we said do that last time. We I know. Did. I just don't. But like, we will. I don't like dogs in the kitchen. Maybe. I know. Especially our dogs. Good. One of them. Okay, guys. Hello. Uh uh. Sit. There's. There they are. Yeah, they are good girl. So this is how they sit while we cook, you guys. They just sit and watch. They just them. sit and stare and stare. I know, Brandy. I'm so nervous. Does Mama love you? Right. Who's Mama's big girl? Look at Mama. They're looking Baby. at the pork. They want pork. See, I love when Nova turns her head sideways. Novi, Mama loves you. <laughs> Mama loves you. Okay. Yeah, nobody's coming in this trailer with those little things. I know, they are very... Head. I never worry about locking my door <clears throat> whatsoever. Hey, is that freckle face? You gotta turn it, yeah, turn it to Mom, us. please, I'm nervous. Mom, please turn don't talk to us, me. Baby. I am. Hey. Okay. Here we okay. go. Okay. This is it after I've mushed it together with my fenners. My fenners. Alright. Those fenners are doing it. I'm gonna do roll call, y'all. We've processed it. You're at, Joe, you're already at 25, bro. I know, it's fast. Why was mine not doing that? I don't know, because your phone sucks. I guess. Oh. Apparently. Okay. Um, now, what are we doing here, baby? What's uh, next? I was gonna put the. I'm gonna do the little, this. little bit of fat in here. Nope. I'm gonna do this first. Okay. Remember, we're mixing together and okay. putting that. So we're not gonna put fat. All right. So I'm gonna mix this in the blender. I'm gonna put a little more. I think. Okay. Good enough. And that's just. That's the broth that was made. From that I boiled oil the pepper. That the meat was boiled in. Yep. I put uh, onion. So like a medium sized onion, like this size. I cut it in half, and I put up four, I would say four, maybe five garlic cloves, that size garlic cloves, in here, or in the pan while it boiled, and a whole onion cut in half, peeled off and everything, okay? And a bay leaf, in the water while it boiled. So the meat now pretty much tastes like a little Mexican, 
Yeah. Okay. But a little salt, a little, little salt in there. I'm going to, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we took, once the, the peppers were soft, enough we just i just took them out of the the pot and put them in here yes and we're waiting then we're just waiting to, to uh now now we put some of the the um the broth that we made broth and the peppers and onions and okay. everything that was yep. in that pot everything that was in the pot there. is in here now all right you can uh, zoom over here all right coming over there Boop. sorry i'm looking for my one of y'all put my hand gave up Oh, yeah. Trying to find the... Uh, right. Oh, it's, it's, it's already good. I already got you. No, I unplugged it. So I know. Thing. And I plugged it back in. No, I didn't. Ah! Oh, my God. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. That's right. Do I need more? Ah! Sorry. Let it run. Oh, my stuff is back up there. All right. Okay. Here we go. 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 Mixer, I'm going to add one half onion because you guys got to remember the onion that I put in the pan seasoned the meat over there. So even though there's the remnants of it, we I put in a half an onion, an extra half. Yeah, because I don't really count the other one as an onion because right, it's already right, gone. Right. Yeah. And then I put in three small ones, three small or I would have put two, two medium salt, pepper, cominos, and oregano. About a half a teaspoon of each, it looks like. Yep. And then I put, you know, about a teaspoon. No, about half a teaspoon. Okay. And then I put about a quarter teaspoon, just a very small amount of gominos. Because this is going to season my, my masa and my carne. Got it? You guys got it? <laughs> okay. We got to get our oil starting to fry up. Yeah. Okay. Oui. All right. Wait. You just put this is the oil that we we just uh, fried uh, all the fat that we bought. It, it's just like uh, just think of it like you got a bunch of pork belly or bacon, and then just. It's it's rendered all, all the fat out of it and saved it. It's all the fat you cut off on your meat. Yeah. Whenever you're going to make a pork roast, yeah. pork ribs, anything like that, it's the white part fat. around the back. We They actually sell it, and then I was going to show we you guys. We cooked it, and then it got all, it was in a package about that about that big. It and says that was pork just this. fat. It was like $3 yeah, just for white, like. White fat, right? Yep. It was like $3 for like a container that just had whiteness in it, and it said pork fat fresh. That's it. That's it was weird. It was weird. Okay, I was felt weird when I checked out. I'm like, mm, this is weird. <laughs> I've never bought like pork fat. <laughs> it was, it was kind of strange. I mean, I buy bacon. I mean, I'm fine with bacon. Okay, guys, here we go. Masa. Masa. Ooh. I'm assuming it's like tortillas, and I I make tortillas well. Okay. All right. I'm gonna put salt and baking powder. Some people don't put the baking powder. I have seen my grandma do it, so I'm doing it. I'm putting for that much. It looks like it's about two cups, babe, or three. I'd say that's about three cups. Three cups. I'm putting two te At teaspoons least. of baking powder, and I'm putting. I would need a little more salt than that. You need more salt? I got yes, it. please. You guys, I literally have to say a prayer and ask them. My. Uh, abuelitas y mi tías to forgive me if I did anything that is not what it should be. Should I put more water broth? Huh? I'm trying to decide if I want more broth. I don't think I think you're fine. I try to do the meat and that. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this is uh pork fat. There's another way you guys can do it. You can either get the manteca and whip it and get it the ma the ma I don't know if anybody knows what that is lard. You can either get the lard and get it ready. This is just pork fat heated up in a pan. We made our own lard. Uh, you basically, uh, we took the yes. actual hard fat and cooked it down to get the, the lard out of it. 
And I'm just going to cook it for a couple of minutes. I know some people, I mean, everybody does it different, you guys. It's so hard to, like, I, yeah, I you mean. can't lock down a, the, the, yeah. a recipe that oh, everybody uses. Oh, I'm strain it before I put it in there. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that's, okay. that's We were just going to uh, make it a little less, uh, and if there were any chunky, little yeah. chunks in there, but. I, you want to sift that and break up all the pieces? Yeah. And then you can arrow it, name it, aim it down. Thank you, baby. Oh, uh, they can watch both of us. I got it. Oh, okay. This is just some bacon, or some, not even bacon fat. It's just pork fat mixed up with the... You got stuff in here already? Yep, the, baking powder and salt. Okay. Did you put a little more salt in there, Daddy? I did. Okay. Uh, how much do you want? You want like, that's about a yeah, yeah. good tablespoon. Oh, no, no, half of that. Half of that. Half of it? Yep. Half tablespoon so half far? Half tablespoon. I think it's three teaspoons. Which is almost four cups of flour. I wonder how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon. Two and a half, I think. You guys, I'll answer some questions in a second. We're like, I mean, I think that, I don't think we're nervous. I just feel like as my, out of respect for my, like it's going to make me cry if I even think, say it. Because I was thinking about, like it just reminds me of my grandma Pacheco and, and yeah, it just, sure it, does. it makes, I just want to do it right for them. That's it. I want to do it right for all the people that, um, like, their grandmas. All the people watching, the grandmas, the abuelitas that do it, I want to do it right for all of them. That's all. It just, it affects me differently. Yeah. Soul food, baby. It's soul food. Yeah. I mean, I just, I love that we have heritage. I love that we have our yeah. ancestors. And I don't ever want to disrespect somebody that... Like if their grandma's or my grandma, my grandma, my grandma is just so amazing. Okay, I'm gonna do right, it just for a, a couple minutes. I get you ready. I'm gonna put that in a bigger bowl so you can blend it well. Yeah, this yeah, is our yeah. meat, you guys. We're gonna get some of this flavored stuff that we have. Uh, I don't know, a sauce. Mm, I'm a bigger daddy. Bigger? <laughs> Shut up, Joe. <laughs> I'll use this one. I'll use this one, man. I got this. I hate you. <laughs> Big enough? Oh, start taking out some of the husks. Yeah, I will. No mind to show them the husks. Okay. All right. Okay. Get rid of this bowl. Since we don't want this bowl. You guys, look at this. These are our husks. Been soaking what? in water all overnight. Oh my god. So, what? You gonna put some in there, or what do you want to do with it? What? The water out, or are you gonna just leave it in there? You just drain them with your hand. I'll just drain them. Okay, I'm going to move this out of the way, this out of the way. There you go. All right. This thing over here. i just pull them from the Anybody who's first time out. coming in, you guys, we are in an RV. Our, our, um, so our kitchen's a little room, bit room is smaller. So we kind of have to move things around. Yeah. It's definitely As soon not as I can get this a little bit hot, I'm going to stick it in there. It's wanted to go for at least, like, I want to see a bubble, like, plop in the middle. Once it plops, and then you can mix it with this, Daddy. All right, yeah. Ooh, it makes me nervous. Switch these right. Like yeah. Right there. I'm so scared. You want to do roll? Give me some. Let me see. Hold on, hold on. Just gotta cook for a minute. Okay. I'm just gonna go on here for one second and check out people's. All right. Oh, so love you. Oh, that's Italian. I don't know any Spanish songs, huh? Or Mexicana songs. No, you son of a Joe, I'm gonna fight you. <laughs> I don't. I, mean, I don't know any Mexican songs. Cranking the heat a little bit just All to right, get this get going. Get a boy. Hey, Regent. Grateful Countess Tara. Get it to a boil so it will, so we can Mom, Mama too. Oh, I gotta get my glasses. Cannot see. So like I said, this is just rendered fat or lard. Uh, hey, Burks, Rage and Countess, Mom of Two. The juice, the uh, uh, Burks, 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 great broth bones. from us I love boiling Alta, the pork and onion and face, peppers. Bootsy. And then we blended Thank all the peppers all out of it. Here. Bootsy, Share Bear, Bob. A little extra big old Grace onions in there. Good to see you, Mama. And blended the crap out of it. And now we got oil. And the Kitty. blended veggies and Brando, broth. my little baby niece. Warming it up. Mamacita, my daughter. Dusty, those pictures are amazing. 
Tara Burbage. Thank you guys all for being here, you guys. I really appreciate it. Absolutely appreciate it. Tate, you want to taste that? See if it's got enough salt for you? It probably needs more. Ooh. Needs more? Who am I? That's good. Huh? Yeah, this is very good. That's good. And we didn't put no, I know some people put nor or whatever that is, uh, nor chicken or broth or whatever. I think it's got, it's all flavors. Yeah, bouillon. That's what it's called, Daddy. Yeah, we're keeping it all pork today. Yeah, <laughs> I would put chicken if I was going to make the chicken ones with the green. But they they do put the that. chicken in there. You ready? Yep. We right. flavor our meat. Joe, stop. You're making me nervous. <laughs> You're making me nervous. Don't say it like that. What? Flavoring the Flavoring pork. Flavoring our meat. Flavored in the pork. Okay. I'm going to try it's that and see what it looks like. Yeah. See how wet it is? It's going to soak it right up. It already mm, did. Yeah. Put more. Okay, hold up. Hold up. Is that broth? Mm-hmm. I wish I had a different spoon. Why? Because it's so tiny, this little one. Do oh, you want a, a ladle? Right there. How much do we think? One more for now. Right. Yeah, that's, that should be good. Good? Yep. Because I don't like the whole red no, funkiness. No. Mm. That looks good. You want to try a little piece of the meat? Yeah, I'm going to try a little piece. And then I'll do the other one. Excuse my fingers. Oh, uh, yeah, don't do that. That's gross. We're on a cooking show. Good. Who carries their noodles around like this? <laughs> Joe, don't be picking on it. <laughs> All right. Okay. I'm gonna do it before it goes in there. You think? Mm. Or you know, why? You're just gonna just there's no hardly no chunks in there. It blended up pretty so? good. Alright. I think you blend it up pretty good. Don't even worry about it. You you see how much you gotta go. Let me put right more there. Oh. Why did you do that? Move it around. There you go. I just don't want it to be red jalapeno. It's not red really jalapeno. Okay. You guys, we're not nervous. This is nothing. We're brown. We This is natural for us. Or me. No, it's really... It's it really... needs a little more heat. Really? I think so. Then put some uh, red pepper flakes. I don't mind hot. Mind? No, I don't mind hot at all. Ah, where are the red pepper flakes? You guys, we put the, in this pan right here, there it's chicken, or the, whatever, uh, the pork that I boiled the meat in, I, I boiled the pork chunk butt with an onion, garlic, and a bay leaf. Once it was ready, I pulled on it, and I saw the bone was going to come out. That's how I tested. I've, I mean, I've been cooking for a lot of years, um, and when I see that the bone's ready for it, then I end up taking out the... Um, I turn off the fire, I take out the peppers of it, and I put it in the mixer. I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> in here, this has masica. Baby, can you grab the, the bag of it? Baking powder and salt. This, the, I know that there's some people that put manteca in this. <coughs> we did it that the manteca was liquid, like this, and I added it to that. So just so you guys know, there's a there's manteca in it. I just, uh, the way we make it is, we mix it with this already, and then it becomes all a sauce. And we, pretty much that way we can flavor, we can see what flavor it needs. Do you, you wanna taste this? Just you tell me what the flavor it needs for the meat. I gotta put this down and use my hands. Mm. You need anything? Nope, I don't think it tastes good. Okay. Look at it. Ah. <laughs> Take it. That's from the... It's okay. It's gonna be good! I'm nervous! Want me to do that, baby? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you need me to... Just kind there? of like get into... Get in... Get underneath the bottom. You guys aim it down just a tiny bit. Yep. Get in the bottom like this, and you're gonna grab the dry part and you're gonna put it up and just keep folding it. That's you're kind of gonna fold it in. Mm. 
and it's kind of like almost like tortillas when i make tortillas remember i was telling you guys just kind of move your hand around in there all right baby you wanna, i'll get it yeah because yeah. i know it's Woo! So, fun. so a little bit on the heat side look at my hands a little red okay all right and i put the last of this yep and then you put some more broth in watch i'm gonna take this joe i bet you yep yeah, we should have done it a long time ago. It works <laughs> pretty good. All right. I'm going to put you the broth in there, though. I don't want any of that now. It has not been blended. Watch out. This is just the broth. Watch your hand. You don't have to sift it. I am. Look at it. Just let it go through it. No, I will not. <laughs> okay. Let me put my... I'm going to read some comments. Oh, uh, that's really hot for my hands. My hands are, you guys know, my hands are really sensitive with the thing I have. So my husband's going to step up. Thank you guys for being here. Thank you so, so much for being here, you guys. I know we're, I'm, I, I, I just want to apologize if there's anybody at all that is feeling like, I'm doing them a disservice from doing it not the proper way. We are really, I mean, we really want to do what you guys, if you guys have a little bit of a challenge for us, I think it's kind of fun. Hey, um, would you put more broth in or I'm more busy, fat sir. in? I'm busy, sir. I'm busy. Listen, ma'am. <laughs> what do you need, Dad? Would you put more broth in or more fat in? I don't think I'm going to want to put more fat. Let me feel it. No more fat? I think the fat I content's good. I definitely need some more broth. More broth. I'll, I'll put more fat, but I, it definitely is broth. All right. Ready? There you go. Hold on, hold on. Good. And then you kind of feel it. It should feel smooth, yet, I mean, it's going to feel it like It takes corn. a long time to do it like this. Yeah. Hey, Hazel. Oh. <laughs> It almost be pasty, almost. Freckle right? face, you got tamales with deer meat? Holy crap, y'all. Y'all, jeez. Region, you. Uh. Region, the best the place. This, the, the better best it's going to be. This is the bushes, girl. Let me tell you, I love my bushes. Hey, baby, you want to give me some more? He's all, you're in Australia, I forgot. Babe. Yes. It's all gone? Yeah. Let me feel. It's thick. Wow, Joe. Get it. A little more. A little more moist. Mm. What do you think? Yeah. Woo! Needs to be kneaded more, but. No, just turn your side. There it needs. Here, hold on. Alrighty. See all those little red things we wouldn't have if you had done it? I you don't know. mind? No. You guys, there's, uh, there's, um, if anybody can see, ideally, before it goes into your this, you'll want to sift because I had some stuff in it. So that's what the little red spots are, you guys. I totally forgot about it. And I just, the chili. That's the chili peppers in it because I boiled them. Can you guys see a little red spots? We didn't I, sift it out of there. Right? I didn't, I didn't do this, the Not as much filtering it that I was supposed to. My brain was so nerve wracked. It's all right. I leaped into the I think stuff. it looks good like that. Thank you, baby. Thank you, thank you. You're very welcome. You're a kind hubby. Now we're getting to the consistency we need. Yeah. Getting there. It's a very thirsty meal. Yes, it is. Listen, I don't need any critiquing from the head, the Male queen. You know who you is, bitch. <laughs>
Oh, does the masa work good, Mama? From in a, she said she used a mixer. Yeah, that, that's what I thought we were gonna do. You didn't, you didn't want to do that. I wanted the realness of it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the masa is. What do you think? Is it more? Uh, more wet? I'm sorry, Mama. Uh, masa is the stuff that Joe's messing with. It's like when I make tortillas. Corn flour. Uh, any flour. kind of tortilla dough is called masa. And these are... Is it taste okay? She said it's okay like that, not strained. Okay. Well, we strained most of it. Just a little bit of it we didn't. Uh, Burke's Bunch, that's what... Um, it's getting incorporated in there, so you can't this, hardly see them this, anymore. The masa is when you get the flour, like when I make the t tortillas for you guys, and I hold up the thing, and I said, this is what I did today. Need to be more moist? No. We, it, That's good. Yeah. I'm just going to keep kneading it, though. Yeah. So the the this stuff right here is the masa, uh, Burks. This is masa. Oh, my God. Masa is what corn tortillas are made of. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start taking some of those out. We have our meat ready. This will get smoother and smoother the more you do this. The our supervisor's in town. She just arrived, and she's gonna tell. Please, you guys, I have not made these before. So if anybody knows, like, hey, mitten, do this. I'm not against taking any advice. I'm open to anything. I mean, my girl in there is a regular on this, and so I would love any direction where I'm messing up because, like I said earlier, I don't want to, I mean, it makes, need something. you need to get to a sink because it's so, <laughs> you're going to come in here or no? Uh, you got it open for me. I'll open it for you, Daddy. I want, um, I mean, it's not just that I want to do your, my heritage well, but I mean, it's, uh, it's an honor, really, that our families are, my, my mom, my abuelita, my there's family behind this, you know what I mean? Like, it makes my heart excited. Ooh, I'm so nervous. Nervous. So you sure it shouldn't be any any wetter? Or is that good? You want to be able to spread it like that, see? Is that good? All right. Hey, hey. I'm going to put it on the thing and do that, see, babe? All right. There you go. Listen, if I stick it in a glass and it doesn't float, bro, oh, yeah. we're in trouble. I know. We gotta so do, do I not stick it in a glass? <laughs> <laughs> nope. We got to do it. All right. Don't you need cold water? Oh, warm. Cold? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Just put it there. <laughs> it's uh, fine. Put it needs to be warm. Uh, all right. We'll just go warm. Here we go. Oh. Now you show them. Go oh, sunk to the ground. <laughs> it needs, needs more uh, uh, fat then. Yeah, is that what it, it is, Joe? Yeah. Says you. Says me. <laughs> All right. Let me let me I'll get back. I'll do this. You sure? Yeah. Look on there. Ask Commander if it has to be cold water or warm water. The cold water or warm water that we uh, do the the float test. I wonder. Smaller piece of cold water. Okay. Thank All you, right. baby. Cold water. I'll get it from here. <laughs> Joe, any good. help we can get. <laughs> Maybe if it's purified water, it'll be better. I'm going to kill you, bro. <laughs> smaller piece. We have to do a smaller piece. I'll... Let me just yeah, do bro. it off camera. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that's freaking hot as hell. Why did you do hot? I didn't mean to. The red button is hot. Yeah, mm -hmm. I went the wrong one. Joe, we're gonna kill you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you didn't see all the steam yeah, coming I out? I thought maybe the cup was hot for me putting hot water in it. It looks pretty good, right? I'm so excited. I'm really excited. Yeah, we gotta keep keep uh, stirring it up. Yeah, I don't know. Mm -hmm. We're on to the next step. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I think you have to keep kneading it. I think so. Yeah. But I, I read that if you get if it's not if it's not there, then the the fat is what helps it. Why don't you read? Okay. And you then want... commander's trying to direct us. All right. Uh, I bet the masa dough smells good. It does. It does smell very good. It smells like cold. It's gotta be cold. It smells like tamales. Like it smells like that good. That's pretty cold. Want me to whip that up? Like with your hand? Yep. Yeah. You want? Yep. I'll do it. You answer. Watch. See if. All right. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. And I'll whip it up. Sorry, I'm gonna get off my fingers. Oh, you're, you're fine. You want this? Oh uh, no, I'm gonna wash it, baby. Oh, yeah. Nova's asking me to do the. T Look at, she's Joe. Uh huh. I'll do it. All right. Sissy girl. Sissy girl. Come on. They say that it takes about. 30 minutes to actually do No, this. it doesn't. Yeah. There you go, sis. She, like, lets me know. That's the cutest dog. Um, And by the way, Oop. Commander, we had uh, some chichet on us. Something's going on. Low battery. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh, how do we have low battery? Love you guys. I love you guys for being here while we while we suck. <laughs> um, the, this is our, this is a nerve wracking one here. It is. I can't believe I messed up not draining or straining it. Darn it, that makes me mad. Me mad. Man, I'm gonna fly you out to Texas and you're gonna come and help me and I'll have like the best tamales. Poppy's gonna come and be like, bitch, this ain't tamales. These are freaking uh what are they called? Uh what are they called that they do um <clears throat> They're like, uh, I forget what they're called. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna lose my brain. They make them in the palm. They get palm, 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 uh, palm, palm branches or palm leaves. What are they called? They're called something, palm leaves. Oh, she was asking, Commander, she was asking what masa was. So I explained to her what the masaita was. Dude, I'm not lying. Come in. Oh, hey, Anita. Hey, Any cardboard. Hey, baby. What, baby? What? <laughs> we can just keep going. Don't have to. If we don't do it, don't do it. We're going to move on. I mean, you realize this is our first time. And like aunts and us, ancestors and grandmas and everybody. Uh, you think we should put a little more fat in there? Joe, you and your pinch of fat. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think we should put any more broth in it. Okay. But fat, I would say fat would float. Why are you and your damn fat? <laughs> <laughs> what Why did you, you look at me? <laughs> fat or no fat? Bobby, no! Man, she's here! No. Bobby, I'm sorry! Go ahead and put a little... I'm trying my best for you, honey! Shit! <laughs> I love you, Poppy! You my bitch! And I'm sorry, I'm doing my best! As soon as I she saw Poppy, I'm like... Ah! 
enough of a pinch of fat. All right. Just blend in what you have, because we're going to be eating manteca. <laughs> Freckle face, how's it going, love? Okay, we're gonna just go on if it's not. Okay, we're going on. Commander, do we have to get them to float or do we have to stay here? Like we're in freaking school and it has to. Well, they're not. It didn't down drop, fast. but it was. I know. <laughs> pop bus. What are pop bus? Pop bus. Is that what I was thinking about, Commander? You know what I'm gonna do? What? Just to, we're gonna leave that like it is. Okay. And I'm gonna get a little bowl. And, uh, <laughs> maybe we need more baking powder. How about that? Yeah, maybe. What well, are you trying to do, babe? I'm gonna make, like. No. There. Just out of this. Oh right my here. god. And see if that does anything. And if it does, we'll put some in there. Oh my word. Oh Jesus! I'm <laughs> definitely not putting that much fat. Hold on. We'll see if it, if it does, a, does its justice. Okay. No. no. Nope. Okay, let's stop. No more. We're getting go. We're going. Poppy, or Commander, we're going, Burl. I know I'm disappointing you, love. I'm disappointing you. It disappointed me. What's wrong? Why? Why? Because, babe. Because we're... We're... I think should be having baking powder more. Is it slow? No. I was just messing, bro. All right. Is everybody nervous? Is everybody nervous? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What? You guys, we my my Theo used to do the tortilla tortilla smasher to put them to flatten it and then put them in a like circle in there. And I was like, hmm, I was trying to remember about my uncle. My thea, my mom did it. My grandma did it on my mom's side. My uncle on my dad's side had his own place in his own business. It was called Ray the Tamale King. You guys, this should be easy for me. Ray the Tamale King is probably not proud of his, his daughter or his granddaughter. What am I? His niece. Hey, um, what daddy was? What? We don't, we're going to move on, Joe. Oh, sure? Yes! All right. Put that in there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We're, it's all full of fat. Gross. I can't believe it didn't float. It's okay. Depends. Whatever. Floating, schmoating. She said I'll still be yummy no matter what. Yeah. I know, Poppy. That's, did you see what Poppy said? What she said. She said tamales are an art, and we're trying to do it on our first wing. Right. Commander gave us the okay that they're going to taste good no matter what. You know what? I'm going with it. Those are two girls I trust. They're my friends, and I love them, and I'll take their word for it. Aw, you're so sweet, Poppy. She's like, it's in your blood. The Tamale King's guiding you. You're going to make me cry, bro. Don't you know I'm a big old, I'm a big old, uh, what's that called? Cry baby. I get you now. <laughs> you just throw it out there like <laughs> nothing. All right, we're going to masa them up. Yes. All right. So I'm going to throw masa. You're going to do. I'm going to. Or no, I'm doing that. And you're going to do the tying it in a bow and folding it. Sure. You think I can? Well, let's just see if it hurts your hand. Here we go. You guys, give us... Put it on here. It's got to be in your hand or it's not going to be done right. Huh? <laughs> what? Yeah, they don't float, so screw it. <laughs> Put it on your own. Joe. Put it on here, babe. I hate you now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're making me nervous. Everybody's making me nervous. Everybody leave. Okay. We don't need that much. I know, Joe. You're like, what? No. See? See? Okay, we got this, babe. Should we use a spatula? That works pretty good. You like it? You gonna do it uh, you? Sure. And I'll start set the other one? Yeah. And it's okay if it doesn't go all the way in, because there's a lot of, that's a huge one. Right. Just like try to get in the middle. Yep. I mean, shoot, my uncle puts it in just a circle. 
There we go. Wow. Who's Meat. you? Yep. Are you just going to do, do them all first? We can lay them. My uncle used to lay them up on yeah. top. Okay. You guys were, um, I found that, I mean, we like them, Joe likes them with more meat than masa. So if you guys like them with some people, hey, Missy, out of the kitchen, please. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Out. Yep. Wow, Joe, who is you? Joe's got it in his blood, y'all. He thought he was a volio, but no. He's a true Mexicano. That's what Drew said too. He's like, Drew, Joe looks brown. I said, yeah, I know, right? A little more. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. I wonder if I could do it with my spatula, my little one right there. there yeah. I feel like we're in art class. <laughs> yes, look at it. Okay, ask the teacher if we can use the acrylic marker, I mean the acrylic paint next. That's not bad. Not bad. I mean, it, I can start it and then you finish it, no? There you go. Get it, Joe? <laughs> I love you guys. You guys are so cute. Thank you, but Commander's over there like uh, guiding them. She's like, those are corn husks she's using. <laughs> She's like the uh, travel, what's that called at the museum? The tour guide. Joe, you're making me nervous. Hey, there you go. <laughs> you're making me nervous. Who, don't ever tell you anybody that, uh, what's that called, pork? You know what, you guys are, um, my grandma is Aztec Indian, and it was just so, like, ironic that the stuff that we use is, like, stuff just from, like, no would be using, like, corn husks. Who would be using a corn husks? I just think it's cool. It's cool that there's things being used that would be dumped otherwise. My grandma used to make them and we'd all sit, like all the kids and everybody would be like, woo, like waiting for it and waiting for it. And then like when they would start getting close to be like the timer, we'd hear the timer go off. Everybody, all of us kids would come running in the kitchen like, like it was freaking New Year's Eve. Daddy, you're making me nervous. Hi, what am I doing? How many we got over there? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, maybe. I didn't realize during um, the guy told me at HEB, first of all, why are the corn husks in the baking aisle, you guys? Tell me that. I would look for almost in 45 minutes for the corn husks, and then finally I asked the guy, and he's like, oh, they're in the baking aisle. Uh, they're in the baking aisle. They double in price, he said. During, the, during holidays, they drop them. During off season, they said that they don't. Isn't that crazy? Like they take advantage. First of all, they hide them from us. And second of all, when you get there, you get screwed. Yeah, they're not in the... Uh, I thought they were in the produce the, aisle. Uh, like the... Whatever. By corn. How about that? <laughs> by the <laughs> corn, like masa and stuff. The, uh, not even in the Mexican aisle. Yeah. Like the... What's that called? International. Yeah. They were in the straight up baking aisle. Above. You guys don't want to even hear this. They were right above where the... Um, <gasps> I tore it. It's okay. Because I went sideways. It's okay. Oops, sorry. It's all right. Trying, trying to do something stupid. It's okay. There we go. Back to the good Is this stuff. the first time you've ever made tamales, Joe? Yes. No. I mean, I've assisted in spreading them. Then we got we started playing with it and throwing in the masa, and then my grandma told us to leave. <laughs> but I've, I've manhandled it before. Okay. Are they more? Yeah, they're more. How many we got there, Daddy? Uh, one. I feel two, like the people that made these did not take time in their. Um... Three. Hey, Commander, can you freeze this stuff four. once it's made? Like, or does it have to be used? Like the uh, masa once it's seasoned and everything. I'm gonna spread this one out a little bit better. Now it's got, it was folded. Bodega. Your bodega has them, Bobby? All year round? 
You steam them for, uh, if I'm not mistaken, they have to go, you kind of test them, am I right, Commander? We usually do them for about 40, but an hour to two Four, hours? 45 minutes to an hour. Depending on how many you have, how tight it is. But we're going to do our tink at 10. Tamale tink at 10. You guys, shut up. We thought of that. Because we were like, okay, well, once they start, we'll, you know, when we come back, blah, 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 blah. And we're like, oh, even if they're done at 9, we'll wait to taste it with you guys. We ain't trying to do this without you guys. We came this far together. We're not going back. Is anybody getting, like, um, what is that called, vibes? When, you know, how, uh, when somebody, uh cleans or whatever like the way you're watching you do that soothing i don't know some of these i get a little thin some yeah more need more masa no, i just need not to be folded look at that here you some masa look at that you guys Woo! okay let's let's fill them fill them and wrap them all right. Oh, okay. Dang. There we go. That's what I was thinking. The ones from Salvador. Commander, that's what I was thinking. Mexican tamales. Okay. That is what we're doing? Yep, we're going to do the fill them with the, you got the little tying, tying a yes. bow? Yes, uh, they were right here. Yep. Okay, and then the glass right here. Why does our kitchen always look like shambles when we get done? Mm -hmm. Okay, you got your bow ties? Yep. Ay, Dios mio. Ready? Yep. Where's your bow? Over here. I wonder why this broke. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's okay. We'll make it work here. Oh, is that too fat? For that one, because it's broke, maybe. Mm. Nah. It's all good in the neighborhood. I don't, we, I don't think we need to tie them. No? Lay them in there. You think they'll be good? Yep. Okay. And then we'll, well, this is just to lay them in there, y'all. Okay, let's put the meat in here so we can both do it. I'm going to try to do it a little thinner so they go further. Okay. Okay. I feel like I hear Ramona Yella in my head. Just saying, just saying, y'all. But what's that? What is it? Um, it reminds me of when uh, when we were making the <laughs> when we had an assembly line. We made our chocolate covered roses, you guys. It was like a freaking assembly line. It was like, you put this in, you do this. Some of these are longer. I didn't realize it till just now. Yeah, some people cut them. Really? Yeah. Why would so you want to cut it smaller? No, to the same size. So they're all oh. the same size. No, we ain't doing that. We're going to enjoy and embrace. Embrace. Well, that's got some, some masa. Yeah, that's yeah. probably the one I made. <laughs> I like masa. This and this, grab it from the bottom and this. My mom has um, a friend of hers. They make them with beans. They put chili peppers. I'd love to make them with hatch. I wonder if anybody's ever had them with hatch peppers before. If you have, let me know, you guys, because I'm willing to try it. Flat and then fold. And then you're going to grab your bottom and you're going to fold it. That's a flat baby, right? That's why I've seen some people make them all skinny and extra flat. All right, we better do some more, baby. Yeah. Thank you guys for hanging out, being here. Tess, I mean, you guys, I love, Joe's like excited. He's like, I love a challenge. I mean, just because we've never made them before, I think it's cool that we're trying it. I mean, we're willing to try it. If you guys are up for... I mean, some stuff, yeah, I'm like, hey, you guys, I'll show you guys these recipes I know. 
but some stuff I'm kind of like, I've never done it. If you guys want to do it, I'll look into it, research how to do it, and we'll make them. You want me to do some more, Daddy? Sure. Hold on. Where'd my little spreader go? Right there. Saw it. Right here, Daddy. You got it? Yep. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you, kind sir. You guys, I hope you guys had a great weekend making memories with your kids. Please, you guys. Who's that guy? That's uh, your neighbor over here. If I ever yeah. have one piece of advice, it's make memories with your kids. We, I mean, whether we were comfortable or not, when we had our kids at home, we would watch. We weren't even into baseball. My daughter played softball, yeah, but we would um, get hot dogs, basic hot dogs, you guys. We'd wrap them in foil. We'd do hot dogs, and we'd put a little uh, container with some pop. We'd made homemade popcorn, hot dogs, and all the fixing, like pickles. And the kids felt like we were at the baseball game, Detroit playing. So just make memories with your kids, because you know what? We do not have them forever. That's my one piece of advice. If I could have anything, I wish I had more time. And I was a stay-at-home mom. I was blessed to be able to stay at home with my kids. Um... I was beyond blessed that Joe was allowed, you know, not allowed me, but financially we were able to stay home. But man, if I could make more memories and do it all over again, I would do it. it went too fast, too fast. I mean, find you a guy or a girl if you're single that wants to hang out with your kids. Don't settle for a guy that's like, hey, do we have a sitter? Can somebody watch them? There's actually guys that say, hey, Hey, let's let's take the kids out. They'll enjoy the park this weekend versus saying, hey, is there anybody or do we have to have the kids? Your kids are should. I mean, this is just my view on it. They're not going to be there forever and they're not going to be little, you know, like this age right now, eight years old, seven, you know, 12, when they want to hang out with mom and dad, that's not going to be there forever. Um, you guys, if you guys could do us a favor and just... Keep my husband in prayer. He's uh, had a loss in his family. And just going through, uh, we we were committed and wanted to do this for you guys, but he does have a loss in his family. Um, a very close person. So just, if you guys could just do us a favor and keep him in prayer. Um, I was going to say it at the end, but I usually we're kind of like all pumped up when we're hanging up with you guys and... Just kind of didn't want to leave on a somber. So I thought I would just let you guys know right now that, um, you know, just keep him in prayer. Just, he's a, he's a, Joe's a phenomenal man, but he does still have a, a soft side to him that, you know, it's just, I'm grateful that he went through and finished with this. Because we had already had this planned and we just got news today. So I'm grateful that my husband is a warrior. Right, Daddy? That's right. I feel like um this corn husk, for all year long, I'm not going to eat corn on the cob. I'm going to save all my husks. Babe, that's it, bro. You just <laughs> pumping them out like we're Hell like yeah. an assembly line. He makes a can of you're not Mexican. You're I'm a Mexican. I'm a Mexican, not a Mexican. Thank you so much, Poppy. Thank you so much. We, I mean, I've said it before. We're, we're those people that will say we'll take prayers from anybody, anybody. I'm never gonna ever be the one to say, I don't need your prayers. Don't bother praying for me. Uh, I, I believe in the Lord and the Lord's prayer. Babe, I said make them thin now. We got all this dough. Thin. Thin. I get you the letters. That's thin. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to say it. I almost said it. I was going to say No. You don't want my uncles. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> um, what was I going to tell you guys? Give me some. Uh, I love prayers. I think prayers, um, I think prayers are a blessing and... And I think people praying for other people is an amazing blessing that we have a community that if someone needs something or is going through something that we, every, I don't know, you guys, if we see it in our chats, everybody is usually saying, 
hey, I'll keep you in prayer. And I think that's beautiful that people are praying for each other. And these are people over the internet. You know what I mean? Like just random people praying for you guys. I love it. I love it. How's it going? Good. Oh, you're done? Here's yep. a couple. Give me a couple. Mm-hmm. Then we got to set them up on our little device Joe made. I feel like it's a, what's that called? Um, <laughs> men, what's that thing called? Uh, Back to the Future? <laughs> it's like a device like that. Joe's like, got a lid. No, no, no. Like, um, what's the guy? MacGyver. That's beyond your guys' <laughs> time. But back in our days, there was a guy named MacGyver. That's it. That's it? That's it. Last I got one. one. Last one. I need one right here. No, last one. Aww. Yeah. Wait. No. Wait. <laughs> Skin it out. Oh, there's more. This will be yours. <laughs> mm. All right. Here we go. Tamales. Saw, you know We're Look doing this, it. Joe. Look at this. Whatever we got here, that's what, what we got. Call them tamales. Call them Papa Pio's or whatever you said, uh, Commander. Look at Joe. I found that in there. Hey. Oh, yeah. That's good. Yeah. Commander said they're called Papa somebody's. Yeah. Didn't need the ties, I don't think. No. no. What if it don't work? And we open the band, it's a whole pot of mush. <laughs> we're like, maybe we didn't need them. <laughs> Here, Daddy. And then we'll get the we'll get the thing out. Yep. It's already over here. Oh, here. Thank you. That. You guys, the contraption that men come up with. I'm telling you, they should have been given a peace, a Nobel Peace Prize, whatever that's called. Oh, I'm sorry, sugar. No, you're fine. Come on in. Boom. We're going to the next stop. Sorry, sorry. I don't know why I get so nervous, but I'm so freaking nervous. Do you have to put hot water in it first, or? Commander, speak to me, baby girl. Hot water. Like this. You're gonna put that hot water. Hey, do that, babe. What? Put hot water from there. Over here? Yeah. Right. No, no, no. Just grab a cup and. Here. Cup. There you go. Right. Fill it up. Fill it up. You guys, we're on the home stretch. I mean, for someone else, this might have been like a walk in the park. But homegirl, she's scared. And we got the penny, you guys. Joe, where's our penny? You said there's a penny in here already. No. Ay, cabron. Um. Bro, we have no pennies. Y'all y'all think I was joking when I said we flat broke. You don't even got a penny uh, to our name. Uh, I got the jar in there, in the bedroom. If I don't have to walk up there, why would I go up there? Right. <laughs> Ay, Dios mio. Walk up there. Huh? Oh, you got a penny. Penny? This is the penny rule or test or whatever we do. You get a penny and you do that. Why? You say? Because if it, I come on, you scared me right behind me. That's enough. That's enough. Well, we're gonna, is that enough for an hour and a half? Mm, no, well, or an we, hour? we'll have to keep. Okay. Well, we can put regular. We don't want to put this. Oh, okay. You guys, if we hear it start going, that's the penny bouncing around. It needs more water. That's what the penny rule is. Okay, guys? So some people know it. Some people don't know it. We're not going to need any more water because I got this thing up high enough. You can put as much water as you can. Just get. shut up. Hell yeah. You're so dumb. We ain't no bottom feeders. Joe, this. you're crazy. <laughs> I'm going to knock you out, bro. Okay, let's do this. Move this right. out of the way. Put the top in. Okay. 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 All right. You guys, I love you guys. I, I need the cup. I appreciate you for being patient because for the last the two The cup months, goes in. In the middle. What's that for? To lean them up on there. Oh, I thought you had the bowl. Oh. oh, that's fine. Whatever you do. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I thought you, remember you were going to put the tan bowl? That middle? thing is too big. The oh. tan bowl for the big, the big oh. one I had out there. This is a smaller one. Or you want you want the bowl? You want the no, bowl? No. I don't think we have enough for this. Commander said we can also use foil. All right. Well, right we're here. gonna. It's right here. Yeah. Put the bowl in there. Okay. 
There we go. We Here's don't our have contraption, enough. you guys. Yeah, we don't have Let enough. Let me take it over there. All right. See you guys? There you go. All right, here we go. We're going to lean them in there. <laughs> but, oh. you gotta be, this is tamales. <laughs> we do it with care. Oh, you got to line it, baby. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ay, you're supposed Ay, to do yeah, this, Cavron. Yeah. Here, do that first. <laughs> it's okay. You don't take anything out. Just right here. Ay, you went all the way down. Yeah. There. There. You're going to do it, baby, because you're like, here, hold, grab some and start taking it around. Lean it on there, you guys. The ideal is to open it up and lean it on the side. Commander's going to be like, Bitch, what are you doing? Commander, I told you, next time we're flying you out because we try to do this just a white man and a Mexicana that has never done it. Oh, blend your part, large version, so I have consistency. Oh, are you doing, um... Yeah. All right. Wow, she does hers in wax paper to keep them more moist. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds cool. Next time I'll try that. Lean them in. Folded side in. Man, there's a bad bitch up on this channel. Woo, woo. Get it, girl. She's like our little, our real Mexicana. I appear to be brown, but I'm really a coconut. All my Mexican people know what I mean by hey. coconut. The water doesn't matter. Just bring it to a boil, she said. I you don't have pennies in Canada, Bert? No, they have toonies, loonies. Stop it. Yeah, probably of any coin you have at the bottom, Bert. Poppy, you do not. I thought you were a Mexicana, Poppy. Ay, ay, ay. That is funny how things, she said that their family's Russian and Finnish, uh -huh. and the only person that, that's born in the States, and my babushkas used a penny as well. Really? It's like all the things in the world they use, like those right. are like old, like not old wives tales, but like, like cultural things, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll have to try that one next time, Commander, because I was going to do it like that. Puppy, it was no problem, babe. I appreciate you being patient. Really appreciate you being patient. I told you, like two months ago, you were like, man, can you do tamales? I'm like... I will. And then I was like, oh my God, what do I say? What do I say? There we go. We're all stacked in there, baby. They call us coconuts because we're brown on the outside and white on the inside. She saw me. Stop. Thank you, Freckle Face. Um, uh, do you mind if I say it for your mom? I don't know. Yeah. No. No. Kind of insensitive for me being um, okay. doing this. Being warm. Yeah, whatever you want to do, I don't care. It's okay. All right. Ooh, they look good. Here we go. Um, Cover on. Put them on the heat. That's it, y'all. Oh, wait, my toallita. Una toallita. Oh, toallita. Oh, yeah. Here. I got it right here. Okay, whatever. Oh, is that the, is that the fresh one? one? I don't know. Which one is? <laughs> I just took it out. Okay. Use the fresh one. This is to keep the steam in, you guys. You can't push down very hard. I know. I know. Because. This is to keep the steam in, y'all. Ready? Yep. Here we go. Ooh. That's probably like how much water at the bottom? Probably this much. Commander, I was going to do the one with Probably the, because that's how my, this much. Um, my, a couple of different relatives do the manteca and then you whip it with the mixer first. Then this one was a new way. They said that they found that they liked it like this. So then I was like, well, I mean, it's a win or lose. Like we, 
I don't mind trying one. Next time, maybe I'll try it the other way. But I had always seen it whipped with the mixer to the Manteca first until it gets like um, oh, soft and creamy. Um, tuck them in like a baby. <laughs> okay, we're done. That's it, right. you guys. Holy moly. Oh, what, how nerve-wracking was, was that? It was very... Holy moly. Holy you know what, holy. Poppy? Um, one, you guys, uh, you, one, you were waiting so long. And number two is once you send me a cash app and it was intended, I know you wouldn't have minded if I kept the cash app either way. But my intention is if somebody is actually saying, hey, this is to help you out with the items that you're going to need for it, then like that's, I feel like it's like rude for me to go, oh, we'll use it for this instead. Like it was going to be used for what you asked me to, to make. So anyways, that's why we did it. It was my pleasure because it was exciting. Like there's stuff, there's... Um, Sunflower wants me to make a cake that's really famous, a gooey cake in, um, in, uh, St. Louis, I think she said. Um, but I like it. I think it's cool that, um, they're, you know, like, uh, uh, pa uh Burke's Bunch wanted sweet tea. And I'm like, yeah, like, if I know how to do it, I'm like, I feel a lot more confident. See how this morning I was? And I'm like, woo, I'll make sweet tea because I'm like, I know what I'm doing. Today, I was like, oh, woo. Like, I didn't have anxiety because, like, certain things give me anxiety. Like, I get anxiety really bad. Um, like, just well, things. this was nerve-wracking. It was just nerve-wracking because I didn't want to mess up. He was, because we like it, challenges, but I felt more, like, uh, emotional to this. Because, like, I always tell you guys when I cook this, it reminds me of my dad. Or it reminds me of my mom. It reminds me of my brother, my older brother that passed away. Like, to me, a lot of things are very, um, uh, very hard for me. Like, my heart is in, is in it. And if it's about my brother or my dad, um, I want to do it so good. Well, this is for my grandma, and I wanted anybody whose grandma's, or even commander, whose ancestors showed her how to do it. Like, I take it such an honor to be able to do something that somebody's, grandma or aunt or anything that it's going to remind them like for commander it might have reminded her something of her grandma and i just wanted to to do my best to to have those memories be like uh sacred for them so that's why i was a little bit stressed out um joe was more like should let it solidify <laughs> Whip it. yeah i wanted it to float man i know it's all right it's okay the masa tastes good yeah. Yeah. Really good. I love you guys. Um, you guys are just the greatest, greatest people. Ten o'clock. We're doing the tink. Ten at yeah, tamale be, tink at ten. Yeah, they should be done by nine forty-five. It's the tamale it tink at ten. Yeah. So anywhere from forty-five to an hour. We're gonna then we're gonna test it out. See if they stick to the. If they don't stick to our uh, our uh, husks. Oh, we'll Poppy, done. thank you. We'll check it in forty-five. Because we don't have a lot in there and they're not super crowded, so 45 minutes might might uh, might cook them. So but. you guys are awesome. I I know that you guys, I, we're just grateful. We're grateful we have people that come in and check out our food, and we're grateful that you like Poppy. You waited two months. Like I felt so bad that you know I love going down. You know, seeing you in chat makes me excited. But then I'm like, man, I want to make them for her. And every time I saw your name, I was like, I'm doing it. Like, I'm going to get the cojones, and I'm going to do it, and I'm going to do it. Like, I'm going to do it. No matter how scared I am, I'm going to do it. And I was just grateful that you were as patient as you were, honey. You were patient, so don't thank me for nothing. Thank you guys for allowing Ask us. If, yeah, no, go ahead. For allowing us to um, to experiment and to do different you, things. To, to be here for you. Yeah. This is, hey, it's an honor. Yeah, it is. I mean, that, it really is. That's a ask, guy saying that. Ask them ask him if they want me to uh, for Mitten Mama. we gotta, we got to make up another Mitten Mama. So it says Mitten Mama instead. You think so? Yeah, I think so. I we mean, everybody knows Mitten Mama. Mitten Mama. Mitten Mama. This is like Facebook first. stuff. Yeah, we used to have our channel on Facebook, and it used to be Love at First Bite. But we're thinking about putting Mitten Mama and then Love at First Bite. So that way it ties in both yeah, of our channels. So I'll draw um, up something different, and we'll see what you think. But I would like one with Andy on it. With me and you? Yeah, like you standing behind me like you always do. Like just you coming over the side. Mitten Mama and Pop. 
<laughs> in the poppy. So what do you want? To, what do you want us to say? Mitten pop. Ask them if. They, How about mittens? Mittens love at first bite. Like M I T T E N S. Well, we'll put Michigan on there too. I'll put Michigan in there somewhere behind. How about us. we take the clock off? Because yeah. we we try to do things to be a thirty minute meal. Yeah. That's why we That's did like the. A little the timer, stopwatch, yeah. a little stopwatch. That's what our, when we were on Facebook, our meals we tried to get them done in thirty minutes. Um, so that's what that's about. But if we take that off, but if I might use you like you are here, just and then me next to you. In the my shadow right there. See it uh, on the back? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Where the shadow is, <laughs> it'll be me. Over okay, there. we'll be back at ten o'clock, you guys. Mwah, 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 mwah. I love you.